Hey, what is going on guys, Bridge Fusion here, and today I'm with you for another video, and today's video is a Minecraft tutorial on how to build a locker room. Now, I know you guys do want to see quite a few tutorials from me, so I am going to be trying and do them for you guys. So, what you're going to need to make this, you're going to need blue concrete, or whatever colour concrete you won't need to use for your arena i'll get to that in a bit light gray concrete you will need that one dark oak wood stairs it depends what color you'd like for where the people are going to be sitting and getting changed tripwire hooks oak sign you can use whatever sign you wish and i use dark oak door but you can use any oak doors or any doors that you wish to use so with this one you don't really need to follow a proper step-by-step -step kind of side because all backstages are like a lot different like sizes but for today I'm going to go one two three four five and then additional ones on the end and then I'm going to go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten just like so and then one two three four five five I know because then it would go like that so yeah we got 10 right here going all the way down from the in block to this block and then plus one and then we got one two three four five right here and then we can join this up so I'm just literally doing uh one two three four five right here and then a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, right there. So it's just a little design. It's only going to be literally temporarily because obviously, like I said, it is all different sizes. And for the bottom bit, I do like to keep it into the colors of the arena. So let's say this is the All State Arena. So you'd use this color, the blue. But if it's another arena and their main colours is like red or anything, you can use that. That's why this bit is like very, like, it's up to you really. And then what you're going to do is get your oak wood stairs and then place one right in front of you like this in the corner. But with a one gap right in front of you, just like so. And then with the gap that was in front of you, you're going to go to the side of it like this. And place it down like that so then you get a nice little corner effect right here so you're gonna do that same on both sides and then you're gonna join them up because if you just place that one like that and then just go straight down like this they won't join up so you need to make sure the corner one is to the side just like that so once again you just literally have that one placed there and then place one down and then you can place the rest there. So we're going to do the exact same. So we're going to make a layer with the grey concrete. We're going to do that twice. So we're going to do it once. And then twice. Just like this. And to be honest, I'm actually going to go up three. Just then it's easier for the next part to do. So go up three with your grey concrete. Just like this. And then what you're going to do, you're going to do the exact same what you've done down here, up here. So you're going to go one, two, and then on the third block, you're going to place one upside down. You're going to place another one facing you just like that. So once again, in reverse order on this side, you're going to place it facing you like that. And then you're going to go underneath and place it just like so. And then you're going to join it up. So that is literally the place where they get changed and then the tripwire hooks goes all the way down here so it goes all the way so then it's like where they can hang up their clothes what I do sometimes is do it like this so if you do want to do it like that you can do so there's a little gap but why not let's just have it all there I wish there was one could be placed here but you can't then I would have done it here as well but we're just going to do it like that for now and then over here we're going to just literally knock a bit of the wall out. And then we're going to place some flooring. That's what we're going to do first. With the flooring it can literally be whatever you like. I like to use the 
not the grey concrete. I like to use the wool, the grey wool, because that's a nice little finishing touch on here. So let's fill in the grey wool. Right, so the grey wool is all added in, as you can see. Now what we're going to do, where you opened up for the door entrance, you're just going to literally place the door, and then either on the left or right side, whichever you prefer, you're just going to literally place down a sign, and usually I do like men's locker room and then women's locker room, but for today we're just going to say locker room. So you're going to put a sign down here, and just like so, and then you know which room is what. So the locker room is just like so. And then there's two more bits to add. And that is the painting for the TV. And then we're going to get some quartz block and also some glowstone. So let's quickly add in the roof first, this little ceiling area. So you're just going to do a one layer going around the edge, just like this. And then you're going to do another layer going around. So then you should be left with a one, like, with, like, in the halfway point, just like this. And then in the middle, that's where you're going to add in the lights. So it you can add them wherever you like. Because this is an even number, what I'm going to do is have two this side, two this side. And then add a block here, block here. And then fill in the rest. And... That should be nicely lit, just like so. So that light is literally however you wish to have it. And then lastly, thankfully, for my texture pack, I do have the TV on my paintings. So you can add a little painting here if you wish. It's up to you. You can leave it. And what you can also add to make it look nice is to get an anvil and then look where the leaves are. Where are they in this one? There they are. You can get your leaves. Let's get these leaves. I've never heard these leaves before. I can't even pronounce it, let alone remember them. And then, yeah, you can add in a little part like that, which looks really nice and adds a little bit of, like, say, decor to the place. But that is really it, guys. That is my little tutorial of how to make a locker room in minecraft for your arenas if you did like it please make sure that you do smash that like button and if you haven't already please make sure that you do hit subscribe and if you'd like to check out my other tutorials on how to build stuff in minecraft make sure that you do check out the playlist link down in the description below i will be making the toilets and showers tutorial very soon so make sure that you do check that out and also, if you would like to put a suggestion in of what you want me to build, I won't be able to do, like, say, big arenas or anything like that. But it's just little stuff like this that will hopefully give you a little helping hand when building arenas and, say, the interior of it. But yes, I really do hope you liked today's video, guys. I've been Bridge Fusion. I really do hope you like this video. Leave a comment and subscribe for more. Peace out, guys.